Right, this one's for uh, Carty and anybody else who's kind of into um, this stuff. Not so much Warhammer, but the uh, roll, uh, not the roll, the um, uh, turn-based strategy games. Okay, this one's obviously based on Warhammer 40k from Games Workshop, and it's called Battle Sector. Uh, you can get it on the Steam um, sale at the moment. I think it's on sale. Yeah, Steam sale, and you can get it with like CD keys and various other places where you can buy the keys for Steam. Pretty cheap. Um, oh, what have we got? What have we got? Um, okay, let's keep it simple. Um, let's just jump into a quick skirmish match. And we'll replay a really short one, which will be the first mission in the campaign game. So we will be playing as the 8th Company Space Marines. Um, I think. Hang on. Yeah. Okay. So the Blood Angels. Here we go. Um, yeah, whatever. Do I need that? Strike force. Oh, sorry. Here we go. Let you read that. Dum da dum. No. Why? Why? But pause if you want to read it. I'm not spoil the story for you. Okay, so it's isometric 3D that you've got control of with your mouse to get a good view of everything, and it's turn-based. So what have we got? What have we got? What have we got to do here? Okay, so when we're starting up, um, we can place our troops before the match starts. So we've got some enemy here, enemy here. My lead character's out here, for some reason. And we're all inside this ruined church. More enemy coming in over there. So I can place my guys down. So what I'll do is place my guys down. Um... Let's put you in a bit of cover. Let's pull you back. And let's get my sword guys to melee them. Put them in a bit of cover. Um, where's my other sword guys? I'm sure you have two lots. Did I have two lots? Yeah, I did have two lots. Can't see them. Where are they? Where are you hiding? You're hiding back there. That's not long, is it? Move you over there. Drag them up. And we'll get rid of him, which is the priest or medic. And we've got... Put him in cover. Bring him over here. And do I want to bring him in? I don't think I can, actually. It's the lead character, the main story kind of character so you can see with the camera you can uh, rotate you can zoom in on the characters right away down here if you really want to and still rotate so with that we will proceed gingerly Dante says that you are blood angels prove it show me that the blood of the great angel flows within your veins victory for the blood blades Victory for Skyfall. I think he's from Yorkshire and he's been gargling with nails. Not quite sure. Okay, so. Um, you've got X amount of points, which you'll see down in the bottom left. So I've got two movement points. So I could move him and then do an action, if you like. If I move on to these red areas, that will take his second point up. So I can move on the white. The orange area, as you can see, is his strike range. So what I could do is be sneaky. My fury will be fast. Use his jetpack, zoom him in there, and attack these from the rear, which will give me extra. On strike. my honor. Here he goes. And then we'll uh, attack you him from the rear. You will me. <laughs> Which is good, which is good. What's that? Okay, no idea what that is. Not been playing it that long. Um, so, 
with these guys. We are the lords of the assault, Doctor. And we're just finishing them off with this. Um, so uh, they've got. We'll just buff up their sword play. On our way. Do you want to the swarm attack? has no right to live. Bye bye, swarm. So at this point, you would put them in what's called Overwatch, which I can't, um, because they've used up their movement. So we'll just move them over here into cover, because uh, the enemy could approach from anywhere. And usually do. My duty remains. What I'll do is I'll just put him over here and put him in what's called Overwatch. So if anybody, when I click this, I can select my Overwatch area. So if any enemy move into any of these tiles, he will attack them. Um, you'll notice the eye colour changes to orange over here, which is getting further and further away from his ideal distance for shooting, which will be there. So we'll just we'll just cover the top of these stairs. Um, Kill zone set. Right, next lot. Uh, which is just select them. They can have a big go with the fancy upgrade. Um, and again, they're moved into cover out the way. Had a little sly poke at them as they came back. We are the sons of Sanguinius. So I'll move him up here. Right, you see the yellow arrow that's appearing here? That means if I move there, they're going to attack if they go there. So we won't do that. So we'll just move them over here. And we'll just throw a grenade on them. Throw a grenade! Thank you very much. This didn't do very much. Have I got any of my little... No, I haven't. Okay. Okay. Um. Hmm. The blood of really Saint this, but... flows in my veins. We'll send the medic in just to uh, finish them off. Again, he's got a melee weapon, a melee weapon. Uh, what's that? Energize the red first of a single friend now. Okay. My chainsaw thirsts for their blood. So you get a lot of kind of upgrades as you move through the missions. You earn points, which you then unlock through a skill tree. Um, different skills, which you then kind of it's bestow upon your characters to give them extra powers, as it were. So I'm going to go... Oh... Where am I going to go? I'm going to go there My for now. So I'm not finished with him just yet. So we'll move um, these guys support. over here. We'll put them at the top of the stairs. We can handle it. I'm going to use these on Overwatch. So they've got a bit of cover from height, and they've got a bit of range from height. What are these guys doing? Who are you? Oh, Victory right. for the Blood Blades! Victory for Skyfall! I'll stick him there in case he needs to use any uh, of his special powers. Close combat support! No, I can't move him up, so we will use him in a different way. So Assault they've got no overwatch, but I can face them a yes. certain way, so if they get attacked from that direction, this guy has got overwatch, and we'll just cover that back They will fear entrance. to tread close. Same with him, again overwatch, and he can cover that area in case he sneaks around that stage. way. These guys are all going to go on Overwatch because they've got quite good range, as you can see. 
Um, we're going to leave them here, which is their optimal range, because it oh, is set. a big, wide area. Same with these guys. Slightly shorter range with them. I don't know what they're going to be able to see over here. Oh, they're, they're fine. Okay. Uh, what were these guys? Battle line squad no. ready. You can move between. Let's just get rid of that. You can move between the units uh, if they've got any abilities left, like this guy. I await their mistake. Once they're all done, they're done. So now we end our turn, and then the enemy get to go. You see a bright white line. This is the guys on Overwatch. Now. around a bit so they're going to attack these but we've got them facing that way so they've got um, a kind of a last ditch defense next lot coming in this is where the overwatch from all of these three units is going to come into play cover working against them there Stairs. Yeah. So now it's my turn. So before I forget, because these guys, in fact, what I'll do is I will just give these a, a whack in case they need to the way back. By the blood. <laughs> um, move him forwards. No, he's gonna. Yeah, move him forwards. Shouldn't get attacked. First aid these units. The blood is strong. Do not falter. And then we'll attack these two units because they're pretty weak. You should get rid of those. Okay. So these units haven't again got Overwatch, but not a problem. We'll put it on the same where they're looking that way. Now then, this white line is as far as my units can see if that makes sense so what I can do is I can send these guys down I'll send them all the way down just to scout ahead and you'll see the white line moving which reveals two more units um, so we'll use this supercharged shot on these guys we are taking fire! The problem with this is they can take damage themselves when they're uh, charging up the weapons. This is just the first mission of the, uh, the, uh, the, the main story thing, so it's pretty easy. Um, now I know they get to the stir, so I'm going to move... Fire support ready. Them put them on an overwatch but put them at optimal range put them down there now they may get a bit blocked by this lot no we're okay put it again on optimal range overwatch um yeah okay I'm we are the these sons, guys down ladies. as well here and put them on overwatch as well rather than just charging in because we can't see a lot it's very early on and I can't remember what's what's what okay so they're all at optimal ranges these guys just defend themselves to the front so any of these three tiles pointy with my hand then you can't see that can you we can handle it so the three tiles that lit up anybody goes in there they're gonna have a, a little pop up um Ooh, so there's not a lot happening over here. Not even death will stop me. No, not even death. Which is true. Because he's already dead, apparently. Um, so I, I'm going to put him over here, because I've got a feeling the AI is going to send him up this back passage rather than 
straight up there. So I'll put him on Overwatch again. Kill zone set. Next, who else have we got? We've got the Lieutenant. So I think I'm going to stick him there and see if he's got any power-ups for my guys. Don't usually play with that one. Uh, Grace of Angels. What does that do? Affects all allies within two tiles. 50 momentum games expires in two turns. Leave no room for doubt, brothers. Right, so that's kind of buffed all of them up. Um, these guys. Hey guys. To the sky, brothers. Let's use that so I can get them up. For Sanguinius. And they can go Overwatch on the steps as well. They will regret coming this close. And the last guy, because I don't trust the AI, I'm going to put them there. i caught out too many times with them. They just, they just don't like flanking manoeuvres. I'd rather see it coming than uh, get caught out. Okay, I think that's everything. It can there. only be victory. Oh, we can go on Overwatch. Again, flanking manoeuvre. We'll cover the right. And next. No more next. End turn. Let's see what the AI does. Oh, they've both gone for the studs. <coughs> Force on the right is greatly weakened by the plasma guys. <coughs> These have all, all got upgrades anyway because of the... Uh, the lieutenant putting his uh, command on. And that was it. I said a quick one. You can one. fight. I'll give you that. I don't know yet if you truly are scions of Sanguinius. Or just some ruse of the Arch Magos. Battle will decide. It always does. Immediate assistance required. Tyranids converge at the Volkscaster relay on the cell Veritas western edge. Form on me, brothers. It appears Balfour has decided she's not yet done with you. And the story continues. Like I said, that was just the first mission. Cough incoming. <clears throat> Just a quick one while I've got. Oh gosh, right, hang on. Main menu. Yeah, confirm. Just so you can see some of the other kind of areas. Um, Age of Crimson Dawn is the main scenario. Demonic Incursion is kind of a wave. Scoreboard type affair with the demons of corn just keep attacking you. Uh, planet supremacy that's quite good. Um, so you, you basically it's a, a a land acquisition where you 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 trying to take tiles off each of um, your enemies. So it's you faces two enemies. Um, and you can select which ones they want. Obviously, you can't have Blood Angels versus Blood Angels, but you can have Tyranids, the Necrons, um, the case Demons of Corn, the Orcs, and the Tau, and this one. And you can play as Blood Angels or Tyranids, and you can also have, if you're Tyranids, you can fight against those guys. Uh, and then if you buy the packs, then you can play as any of them. If you like, there is also a multiplayer one. Steve, get practicing. You've lost two in a row now, uh, which is pretty good as well. Um, that gives you an idea of uh, what's in the base level game. Obviously, I've got no packs. I just, just bought, I think it was £4.89 on CD keys or something. But that's it. A quick look. Um, yeah, a quick look at these guys um, and some of the uh, stuff that you can have giggle these are the troops that you kind of get and then build up um, each battle obviously they get uh, better strengths 
Um, but if they die in the in the game, they're dead. You'll have to replace them with standard level one guys. Um, yeah. So as you can see, the uh, these are the models that are in the game. Um, pretty good. Pretty good detail, especially if you're into kind of Warhammer. They're all based on the tabletops, and it is a tabletop game, so you're not gathering resources as such. You're given a certain amount of points and slots. You put your army together against another army with the same amount or similar amounts of points, uh, and that's what you've got to fight with, just as with the, the tabletop game. And with that little salute, adios.